Colossians or he, she, they, it, them, them. 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 It's, it's called, it's, there's it's, a word for it. What's the word? What? I said there's a word for it. I don't know what the word is, <laughs> but that's the word for it. <laughs> Gender identity. Gender identity. Mm, I identify as. A staple. I saw. I saw <laughs> you know, I don't because I saw two days ago. Mm -hmm. I saw guys, two two people on the street mm -hmm. walking. They looked like robots. Robots. Mm. They looked like robots, but they were people. But then they had this. You know this. How an alien looks like. Mm -hmm. Like from alien and predator. Like from alien, and then walking like a robot. But dressed funny, like anyway. That these two guys have been identified as pro-alien robots. <laughs> Let the rapture happen. I said, you guys, this nonsense is getting up. <laughs> now Let the, the other rapture day, happen. I'm seeing that there the, the was a hippo in Japan. That who they thought was a he, they found out it was a she. A, a hippo. hippo. A hippo in Japan after seven years of the zookeeper in the zoo. Think this is a he. He made he made he made. That is he, not he. <laughs> he is not he, like he should. Like he should be he. He's not he. He's not hippo he. he. So they said, hey, let's do a test. Then they found out that the older one is she's a she. He's a she. You are kidding. No, but hang on. It's an animal. It's not like you're going to ask it, are you male or female? But 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 if by the time you work in a zoo. You know, you an you genitalia, know yes. A female hippo and a male hmm. hippo. Jen Chan is the name of the hippo. Jen Chan? Yeah, arrived at Osaka Tenoji Zoo from Mexico in 2017. Jen Chan, all along they said, this is a male hippo. Okay. Like what, the transfer papers and yeah, stuff? Yeah, say male. <laughs> uh -huh. Couldn't they just come and see if the thing had a dick? That's what I'm wondering. Well, like, you like you they don't... Do you have a clone? Are you good to, are you a guy or is your B, B, BJ a BJ? Jen Chan was not displaying typical male hippo behavior. So even the name they Which gave included scattering pieces around, yeah. where defecating, is proper male, you know, you may have go pooping everywhere. And the tail motion was also not for men. Yeah. I don't know, I, I don't understand, like you said, can you just get this? You can look, at, I would imagine like a hippo is in the cow family, right? Yeah, well, yeah. Similar yeah. animals. So it's they the parts are where the zookeeper says we can see them. The importance of to recognize the importance of confirming the sex and what to ensure the star mistakes are not happen again. <laughs> yes, but wait, they said he came from Mexico. Eh? Those Mexicans knew what they were doing. <laughs> they said, You're looking for a male hippo. We got a male hippo home. Oops. He's, 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 he's male. He's male. <laughs> we got a male hippo home. Yeah, that, that is very text. That's very. Even the name that they gave the hippo was a. A, 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 a male. A male name, yeah. Instead of a female. Exactly. Yeah. Gen -chan. Gen -chan. Yeah. But also, you wouldn't you check? I mean, if you're going to spend your money, and you're going to be like, okay, just before they come in, Imagine can we. You fed at zoo, zoo goers for seven for years. For seven years. It's a male hippo. But it really matters, really. It <laughs> does, because why aren't the hippos multiplying? Yeah, that's true, actually. Because <laughs> ideally, I bet they bought a male hippo saying we don't have a male. We need some more. Come to through. multiply the, the hey. We got imagine, your hippo homes. Imagine they were bringing this male hippo. So they probably thought females. that. Females. Kumbe. Kumbe. They thought that maybe this male hippo Meanwhile, is gay. Meanwhile, they were just promoting mm. female and female sex. Yeah, they probably thought this male hippo is gay. Yeah. Yeah. It's really like he? <laughs> Kumbe. Now he's not nah, behaving. Nah. He's yeah, not he, eating. He's not eating. How can he not eating? He's not eating. Tell you eating. Yeah. <laughs> That's so stupid. Okay, stop it. <laughs> stop it. I know, I know what you're going to say. Don't it say it. It is not a hippo. It is a hippo. <laughs> I knew. I knew there was some the nonsense. <laughs> you know, I'm going to hold both of your books now. <laughs> Between a hippo and a sheep. <laughs> uh, okay, fine. Let's talk about men. Let's talk about men. Since you want to talk about men, let's talk about men. So I like to believe you Ghana men are very good looking. I mean, both of you, very, very handsome chaps. I can see that. Man? We have no man. By the way, no way. 
Okay, fine, fine. Let me tell you why I'm saying you're handsome. Because according to the Africa Facts Zone Twitter account, you've seen it? Yeah. Uganda, we are the twelfth most handsome men on really? the continent. In the rankings. Hmm? Who is above us? By the way, I don't agree with this list. I do not endorse this information at all. So, so and I'm glad it's coming from a woman because even me. I do not endorse this at all. Who is harder than us? Number one. Or do you want me to start from the, big, the bottom? It starts from after Uganda, going up. From Uganda upward? Upward. Okay. Who is harder than us? Uganda is 12. 12. 12. They're not even yeah. in the top 10. They're not even top 10. Now that's why I'm saying I do not agree with this. I do not endorse this list. This is wrong. Number yeah. 11 is Tanzania. Tanzania! Tanzania is harder than us. It's Those guys were all five four. <laughs> the whole country is brown five four guys. <laughs> wow. All I can say is tough that. <laughs> Ghana. Ghana is number ten. Ghana. So here's the thing, Ghanaian men. They might have a point. Might. Might. Number nine is Somalia. That is a lie. Somalian men are harder than. Oh, that is a lie. Whoever made this list was not, anyway, was not listing. Why? Why is hard that the Then, this one, they might also have a point. Yeah. Morocco. Moroccan men are hard No, man. They might have a no, point. No, no. Our dark chocolate skin. There are the some. Thing. Please, no. There are some Moroccan yeah, men. Yeah, that's a football. That one I'm saying. Almost, almost, running, but other sports. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Um, then there is Eritrea at number seven. Yeah, but no, Eritrean women are harder than the, 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 the men. <laughs> okay, yeah. yeah. But Eritrean oh, buds are also fine. Yeah. But Eritrean buds are fine. Yeah. yeah but their guys were number their six guys. is Angola. Uh, no, I don't know enough. Angolan buds are hard. So maybe. Uh, so maybe also the guys are. Uh, maybe, yeah. Maybe. Number five is South Africa. Now that one. Hell no. Uh -uh. South African Hell, men. You, you live there? there are some South African men. I've been in Ghana, but if you have really been there, you, you, you get, get the point. Yes, been there. Na, na, kya ufred? Hmm. Meaning. The men in South Africa. Mm. Mm. No, no chance. No way. We're better than them. Really? This one, even you guys will agree. Rwanda. Rwanda. Rwanda is what? Rwandans men are fine. Four. Randy's men. Randy's men are feminine. Not all so of them. So it's not fair. Yeah. No, they, no, Randy's, they, Randy's men no, are feminine. No, they, 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 you know, they, they, they. Wanda is, as 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 is, Number three is Ethiopia. <sighs> number two might also have a point. Nigeria. Ah, ah. You guys, there's some very handsome uh -huh. Nigerian men. What's about the Nigerian women? Say what you have said. You know she meant that. I did not say anything. Just declared you. But now you're going to fight for real. Mm -hmm. Once I tell you who number one is. Let me guess, Kenya. Why? Kenya? Are you kidding? I was joking. Kenyan men are harder than Ugandan men. According to this list, they're number that one. That is bullshit. There's no way. I've been to Kenya. You lived in Kenya. What what is your what is your take Jesus. on this? Are Kenyan men somewhere compared to Uganda? <laughs> so we'll take that to say no, they are not harder than Ugandans. You haven't said anything bad. You're just saying that no, they are not harder than Ugandans. I find that very hard to believe. No, that's that's that's. I honestly find that. The countries that I agree with being harder than Uganda are Morocco and Rwanda and South Africa. In South my Africa, opinion, Africa, right? in my opinion, maybe Rwanda, maybe I don't know about Morocco. No, Kenya, <laughs> yeah. but now there's also some people after us. Algeria is number 13, Egypt is number 14, which I find surprising. Congo is 15, Malawi is 16. Congo should not be on the list. Wow, <laughs> and we don't want to know anybody below us. Sorry, I forget about them. Congo is Nonsense, Kenya, Appa, 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 Appa. That is fake. That is a fake <laughs> list. 
Where That's did they what get it? Where, where, what's their source? Where is it? Um, called something monkey. Inside a monkey. No wonder. Okay, no sense. Speaking of fake. <laughs> Who's the Archbishop of the Church of Uganda? Kazimbamgar. Kazimbamgar. Kazim How do you not know that? Stephen Kazimba. Yes, so, Kazimbamgar. Hey, hey, Many women, this is a quote, and it's a quote mm -hmm. from, from the, Archbishop, the Archbishop of the Church of Uganda. Mm -hmm. Many women spend a lot of money purchasing artificial hips and other enhanced body parts. <laughs> this is ingratitude to the giver, as in God. Mm. Learn to live comfortably mm. with what you were created with. So basically, <laughs> he is warning against women having artificial body parts. You're not allowed to talk. That is your Archbishop of the Church of Uganda. Fake bums, mm. fake hips, fake breasts. We check. Huh? These are not fake. These are real. Or if they are fake, then she, it's a good fake. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still not allowed to talk. <laughs> when you people are running your lips like this. No, you have, you have you, First you're of all, going to give give. last week we talked about this. The bums are real. Yeah. They are very real. And number two, I want to ask, and this is with utmost respect. By the time you say it's most utmost respect, you're just about to disrespect. Thank you. How is this anyone else's business? What a woman wears, fake or real, how is it your business? Archbishop. If you are not involved with the woman romantically. And maybe I want you to be. But he's Archbishop, mm. so he's speaking as him. He's saying, yes, I get it. He's saying that we're being ungrateful to God. But then that falls under a massive scope of things that we're doing that are ungrateful to God. Yeah, but this is now pushing it too far. How? This is called... First of all, you're abusing God. The God are not enough. I must no. add. So you, what you have done, the way you've created What me, if he's saying, the bum that you gave me? Yes, good, by the way. You cannot give me half the bum. You give me the bum. Because God is going to strike you. He's not telling you. You're there telling God, God, you're not serious. You cannot come back to But if I'm wearing the bums, it's, I'm really not That's number one. Increasing number, two, number, two, number two, Archbishop is saying, you must stop false advertising. But also if people pretend to have money all the time and then you don't have money, that's false advertising too. Move again, motor you study somewhere, you come, you're buying everyone a beer as if your bank account is set up like that. That's also false advertising. Or you mavanja, wakute taxi. Choka, you're waving around keys in the bar. That is also false advertising. Choka is in the garage. Teacher me. Teacher me. What is the Archbishop of Uganda doing? Looking at fake bums in the first place. You think it's what? Like, How did he come across this study? Was it a, a research he did in, personally? In charge. In his charge? You think he didn't have a... Ah, we are gathered here today. <laughs> to witness... <laughs> he would really have to pay attention to know that this is real, this is fake. Archbishop, the body is here, the band stays here. <laughs> oh, it's not, it's not moving. It's not, it's not moving. But you know, by the time the Archbishop is recognizing this... Yeah. You think it's a pandemic? It means Jesus. That means it has come to a level yeah. it's where a pandemic. it is too much. We know that they are fake bums. We know that they are fake hips. But, but we have taken it too far. Fako is now no longer fake. Because Fako now you're taking the stuff to increase what you have. <laughs> For him he's talking about the ones yeah, that but, you but, wear. But, but, yeah, but the guy makes a solid point. By the time a man who has no business noticing A man of God! Sees it. Is see it means Jesus Syrian. It is out of order. <laughs>
Come on, we say you get the women, but Archbishop, the Archbishop of the Church of Uganda. You people, stop it. Fake boobs, fake hip, fake. But let me, let me. God gave, gave you a small bum for a reason. I don't know what it is, but what's the reason? <laughs> what's the reason? What's the reason for a small oh, bum? God didn't give you a bum for a reason. We don't know. That's good. <laughs> but guys, I'll ask you something, man. In your community of friends, uh -huh. or in the circles that you're in, as a female, mm. do you see a lot of this? No. But well, that's because all my friends have very big bums, so <laughs> it's not really a problem we have. But so. I think, I think it's, 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 it's a bit of an issue because, first of all, Uganda is general. Uganda women in general. Oh, oh, we oh, have, bums. have bums. Like 70 to 80% of Uganda. You thought you were you wasted at 44. I thought my, my bums and the hips were 44. You remember when we argued yes, about this? Week. I went home and measured. I'm at 52. So the bums are there. So she doesn't have that yet. But most you can remember. They are here. They are with me. Yeah. So they where is the fakeness coming from? What is that? Is it the, the 30% who feel that they don't really belong with the rest? Yes. At the Do you know what it's like? I don't know personally. When you're with somebody, you smack them on the bum of a woman and it's a fake one. You don't know what it's what supposed to What sound does it? It's supposed to go. But a fake one is like. I don't be not your true reader, no gambo batting and no marina chee. Not the same for marina manji much for Jim. It was a lot of shit. <laughs> a full lot of shit. There's, there's not, there's not, there's no, 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 but the rest, her, the rest of us, the rest of us, they did this. You hear? The thing goes, whoop! 